Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to another informed player review with me, Boy FIFA One HD. We are going to be looking at the unbelievable 87-rated third informed two van card. But before we do, as always, it would mean a great deal to me if you would hit that like button so hard that it almost falls off. Hit the subscribe button as well if you are new to the channel, because that really does help me out, and I'm very appreciative. And if you have any questions at all about two van or about FIFA 17 in general. Ask away in the comments below, I'll be happy to answer each and every one of you. So, looking into his stats, and as you can see, there is more than a lot to love here. His attack positioning, his vision, his acceleration and agility, all supremely high stats, which are amazing. But then, surprisingly, his strength there at 81, which is unreal. Lots to love, and that continues when you move over to his skill attributes comparison. You see his ball control, his crossing, his dribbling there at 93, finishing at 86, heading accuracy at 96 also, which is incredible. Long passing, long shots, shot power and short passing, all so, so good. Really does make for a great card. High medium work rates, which I love. The left foot is uh, his strong foot and he plays on the right, which I also really like. He's got three-star weak foot and four-star skills, which is also pretty decent. As well as dribbler specialities, distant shooter, crosser, acrobat, clinical finisher as well, which just make him one hell of a card. So let's get into the main block of the review. So my thoughts on the 87 rated Tuvan card were that he was absolutely mind-blowing. How this guy is available for this cheap is unreal. This card should be used wherever possible. He is one of the best right wingers you will get, especially for under 100k. I'll start off by talking about his pace, which is probably one of the reasons why maybe he is a little bit cheaper than uh, he really should be. And that's because people will see the 86 pace and think, oh, he's okay, quick, but not super quick. You know, people love 90 plus pace on their wingers. And of course, who doesn't? You know, and they'll also, if they look a little bit deeper, see that while his acceleration is good, his sprint speed is, is, is you know, sort of low 80s, and that isn't fantastic. But let me tell you, with the right chemistry card on and playing him probably at right forward, which most of you will, there is no issue at all. He has got enough acceleration to get away from anyone. And what's great about him is even if he is in a tight area or he is getting caught by people, he's got good strength. He's got amazing dribbling and he's got really good passing and long shots. So he can pretty much use the ball however he wants and you're still going to keep it or you're probably going to score if you do take a shot with him because his shooting is absolutely terrific. Very, very good in all sorts of ways. And when I say he can score all sorts of goals, I mean, he really can because even his heading is amazing. It's incredible how many good stats there are on this card. His shooting is very, very precise. And what I love about him is obviously he is a right winger, right forward, wherever you want to play him on that right side. And his right foot is, is quite decent. He can definitely finish with it. But you always have that ability to cut inside onto his stronger foot, open up the angle and use that left foot to really curl it in the top corner and take those shots. What I also like about him is he's got very good attack positioning. So he often moves into good attacking areas whereby you can just use his stronger foot because he'll be more in the middle of the goal or even sometimes on the left side. He's also very good with his one-on-one -on -one finishing. Really neat and tidy. Will score you a lot of goals making those good runs like I said earlier. His passing is also really, really top draw. He has got really good vision so he can find players with absolute ease. His crossing is good. So if you've got a big striker in the middle, he's going to find him every time and plant a lot of balls on his head. Overall, passing-wise, very neat, very tidy. His dribbling is to die for. It feels so good. He's able to turn and twist and just get out of so many tight situations. And just overall, when you add all of that together and then you throw in his decent strength, what more could you want? I mean, like I said, this card is absolutely mind-blowing. It was phenomenal for me. His price is unbelievable at sub 100k and if it does go any lower, my god are you getting an absolute bargain. So I hope you enjoyed the review guys, if you did please smash that like button to pieces, hit the subscribe button if you are new and leave a comment if you want to know anything more about Florian Tuvan and peace.